I am the Nordic Pine Girl and I noticed I didn't fix my mic. Today, I'm gonna make a couple more poles for my plants because now I am repotting everyone. And I like to put the poles in my plants or in the pots when I repot because like that I don't risk breaking any roots and I can organize the plants the way I think they're gonna grow up the best way and I've got more pipes thanks baby because my boyfriend is a plumber and I was like hey could you please maybe and he did that face of like oh here we go then I also went yesterday and bought some jute so I bought actually just a cover they had like they didn't have really the textile like the you know meter by meter meter by meter what so I bought jute and I've got some more jute <laughs> but in the form of a rope scissors I was gonna call it knives and I spent the longest time trying to remember what the heck they're called <laughs> and I got of course the pipes over here I have many different types I'll actually start with one of the medium sizes I made this one yesterday I just realized I don't know how I'm gonna show it to you <laughs> hold on I want to have about this much. I think this is good. I'm gonna get my tape. I'm gonna get a really swift allergy. So now I'm just gonna go around a couple of times before I cut it. I'll cut it. <laughs> so don't worry about like it being perfect right now because we're gonna take the jute out obviously because we're cutting and one thing that I've noticed wait let me try and show you better this is really hard to like have to look down and want to make sure that you can see everything that I'm doing so what I'm doing right now is that I'm checking because I want to put this in here so I'm checking where I should cut it. So don't worry about this being perfect because I'm gonna unravel so I can cut the, in this direction. And like this. Now we can be a little bit more. It's so easy to do these that compared. And like one of the things about because you saw me doing the one with spag moss and even though it's I like the look of the spag moss more I found that that when it the, the the moss is dry it just goes everywhere and the top is, the top is kind of gonna be like that in the beginning but I want to make sure I get the bottom aligned and then there was a hair of course and tighten it up twisting 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 oh. then just go around and now um I'm gonna put the excess in and I'm leaving this excess just in case when I like when I decide to extend this I like to using pipes because it's so much easier to extend so when I decide to extend this pole it's gonna be easy to just make a continuous line up and I'm gonna fix it a little bit the way that it's Top. I'm gonna make a couple of curves here so now if the line is going this way 
wait let me see where is the focus the line is going this way that I'm gonna make it cross on the top and just continue down and that's it if you want I did do this on that one yeah I did just to make the, this bottom here a little bit more close together I'm gonna go a couple of times around it as well trying to make sure that the the tip that we have is free so that we can tie it up and now that I've gone around a couple of times I'm just gonna tie it up and that's it really that's all there is to a jute jute steak pole however you want to call it you know what I mean yeah you do yeah so now I got two got it too anyway but so I'm gonna put it like here <laughs> for the shoot that I killed
Let me take my mic so you can hear me better. <laughs> that could be helpful, right? And tell me which plants you would like to make climb and if you enjoyed or like your preferred material for the poles whether you like coconut coir jute rope moss and like and sub if you liked the video and if you have any questions i'll be happy to answer them down below i'll see you Yeah, now you have a proper pole. But I'm so sad that I broke your your life. The life that you were bringing me, I broke it.